It was December 30th, 1993 at the Forum in Los Angeles when Kurt Cobain dedicated the song Jesus Doesn't Want Me for a Sunbeam to late actor River Phoenix. The song's for River Phoenix. River Phoenix, brother to actor Joaquin Phoenix, starred in several hit movies such as Stand By Me, Running On Empty, and My Own Private Idaho. The dedication from Cobain came just two months after Phoenix's tragic passing. River died October 31st, 93, outside the Viper Room on the Sunset Strip in Hollywood. Phoenix was just 23 years old. His death had obviously affected Cobain somewhat, as this wasn't the only time that Kurt would dedicate a song to River Phoenix. He did it several times in the months following River's passing. River himself never came out openly stating he was a massive Nirvana fan or anything, but it was pretty well known amongst River's friends that he did like Nirvana. It has been mentioned in various books written about River Phoenix that he would go and attend Nirvana shows from time to time. So it was common knowledge that River liked the band. Which made it extra cool, I guess, that Kurt would dedicate that song to River. The song, of course, Jesus Doesn't Want Me For A Sunbeam, it wasn't a Nirvana original. That was a cover that the band did by the Vaselines. A song that they played, too, on their legendary Unplugged show, which they performed November 18, 1993. Now, an extra bit of Did You Know information I'll add to this video is the very next night, on New Year's Eve, December 31st, 93, Nirvana played another show. This was at Oakland, in the County Coliseum Arena there. And Nirvana were playing the same exact song, Jesus Doesn't Want Me For A Sunbeam, except this time when they played it, there was an altercation in the crowd. What you saw there was a male audience member had tried to grope a female audience member and Kurt was breaking it up. So that was the very next night, same song, same stage setup and everything, different arena of course. Kurt didn't dedicate the song to River this night, incidentally he actually dedicated it to Frank Zappa. Frank Zappa, of course, well-known musician, he had actually died just a few weeks earlier on December 4th, 1993 himself, so that particular song Kurt would often dedicate to different people from time to time. So just a bit of extra for experts information there with that song, Jesus Doesn't Want Me For A Sunbeam. But let's get back to the video. So I guess the cruel irony to all this is with River Phoenix dying on October 31st, 1993, Kurt himself would pass away just five months later on April 5th, 94. As mentioned before, Phoenix just 23 years of age and Cobain just 27 years old. Both dying far too young, of course, in tragic circumstances and two guys that the world could have done with just sticking around for a bit longer, right? Both guys dying far too young. But there it is, guys, Nirvana dedicating the song Jesus Doesn't Want Me For A Sunbeam to River Phoenix.